Hi everybody, welcome back to the tween um, drawing class. Today um, is our last class, however, um, please be on the lookout for any other art classes that we're offering um, at the Killingly Library. Um, please go to www.killinglypl.org for more information, okay? Or you can give us a call, 860-779-5383. Um, I am Miss Tristan, and let's start by talking about what we're gonna do today. Um, we're kind of going back to elementary here um, because it's fun. Um, so what I have is loads of colored pencils. So if you have colored pencils at home, you can use those or you can use crayons or markers, doesn't matter. I have watercolor paper, um, but you can use any kind of paper you want. Um, I like the thick watercolor paper just because it's thicker and it's cool and um, I can use watercolors on it if I choose but I'm just going to use colored pencils today so that's what I'm doing um I will focus on my picture in a second let me get you back to my art piece Hold on. hey everybody this is um kind of what we're working on today um it's numbers and you could probably add letters if you would like um I have randomly created just big numbers I'm playing with scale so we have the bigger numbers and um, then I just kind of played with the numbers like it was a clock and then I just started writing the numbers and you know what you might want to uh, think about different numbers in your life like your birthday or how many people in your family how many pets you have um, so that's how I created this way, just kind of thinking of some numbers. Um, and then randomly, I'm just going to add some patterns in here with color, okay? So I'm going to take all my colored pencils and add random patterns. And I'm going to color stuff in. You could do polka dots. It's fun because it's random and you're not really thinking about it. Okay, just grab something. Grab your pencils and start going. You can do some swirly whirls. Fill it in with whatever. You know what? I urge you to not look at the colors that you're grabbing. I urge you to just play, play with your colors here. What would happen if I grabbed? This is like really pretty blue right here. <laughs> so I'm kind of just drawn to those. No pun intended. <clears throat> or intended, I don't know. So creating some kind of cool dynamic piece of art out of numbers or letters. Now connect them together with patterns and colors, okay? and see what kind of relationships you can develop with these different abstract, this is definitely an abstract way of creating a piece of art, okay? It's awesome, because there's no rules, okay? So you're not, you're not failing if you're breaking a rule. These are your own rules. Okay. Neat. So have fun with this, okay? Because it's fun. And um, like incorporate your name if, if you wanted to. Just kind of jumble it up and put it on the page. Um, jumble up your colors. Um, make more patterns. Um, dots, lines. Hatch marks are kind of like the hashtag thing you guys all... I don't know. I don't know what that means. But um, those are cross etching. Um, so you're kind of creating a shadow with the lines. Um, try it out and have fun. Okay. I'll see you guys in the spring. I hope I can do this again with you guys and um, we'll have a lot of fun. Okay. Or we'll do another art program. Just keep your, keep your eyes open and call us and, and see what's going on over here in the spring. Okay. See you guys later. Bye.